Hello Internet. Today is the start of a lock picking journey, hopefully. So this is the first lock I'm going to attempt to successfully pick on film or video or whatever people are calling the moving picture phenomenon these days. If this is a master lock. 1D1, it's an aluminum bodied lock with a 40 millimeter shackle apparently. And this is the only lock in my practice rotation that is actually a lock. The rest are uh, practice locks. So they have the see-through acrylic side so you can look at you know, what you're doing. And essentially this lock's current purpose is to make sure I am not quote unquote cheating while going through my practice locks. Because I can't see through the side of this to see if I've set the pins correctly. It's actually for me to pick this I actually have to pick it. So I'm going to take flip this around so it's oh. right, so I have I have it under tension now. And for how to please go somewhere else, there are people a lot better than me that can tell you how to do this on YouTube. This is merely documenting my own lock picking journey. I have been at this lock picking thing for like about two days. And I still feel like I only have half a clue what I'm doing. I've yet to tackle anything with any kind of special security pins. Or something. Or any truly fancy locks at all. I think I'm putting too much tension on this. Back off a bit. now I'm doing a film I'm not doing as well as I was last time I did this all right let's put you back out try this again Again, half picking, half breaking with a pick. Someone is not cooperating with me here. Alright, let's 
Go ahead, laugh. This is like day two. There we go. So, yes. Well, that wasn't my most successful go through it at opening this particular lock. As for the disassembly that people better than I do on YouTube, I wouldn't even know how to attempt that. But this is the first step and hopefully a successful lock picking journey where I become better at this. In the meantime, this is going back into my practice rotation because as you can see, this still actually provides a bit of a challenge for me. So. That's it for this video. See you some other time, Internet. And have a nice day.